a Texas Tornado Tough Man contest. <laughs> Sound a little confusing to half you pea brains out there? Well, I'm sure it does. Even though it's not confusing to me, it is a little contradictory just in the title itself. Because you see, when you put the words Texas and tough man together, it just really doesn't fit. Because you see, I've been to Texas and I've wrestled all over the state of Texas and I've kicked rear ends from Dallas to San Antonio to Houston and to be quite honest with you, I ain't found a tough man yet in Texas. But what happens is, I guess the USWA happens to be headquartered there in Dallas. So when you get this wimp Jeff Jarrett and his pansy Bill Dundee go crying down to the USWA officials saying that somehow we got to get together and we got to dream up some kind of match to where you have somebody that can help Dundee and myself, you have somebody that can, can try to protect us and come up with some kind of stipulations in this match that can put us in the advantage. Well, I guess that Max Andrews, I guess he's the president of the USWA, he said, well, let's call it not a Texas tornado death match because you boys wouldn't have a chance against Lawler and Gossett and Sweet Daddy Falcone and Jeff Gaylord. You wouldn't have a chance in a match like that. Let's throw in some other kind of stipulation. Let's try to think of some way that all four of you guys could get to wrestle only one of them. So that's what they did. They come up with the Texas Tornado Tough Man Contest. That means if somebody loses a fall, the man that loses that fall then has to face, or either the opponents get to pick a man from the opposing team, and all four of them get to gang up on that one man for a minute. And then if that man's unable to answer the bell at the end of that minute, the match is over. So I'm sure that they're thinking, if they can only somehow pin one of us, they'll pick poor Ronnie Gossett, who's not a wrestler anyway, and the four of them will beat on him and pound on him and kick on him and scratch on him until he's not able to answer the bell. Well, let me tell you something, guys. Good try. Good thought. Good idea. But it ain't going to work. Because you see what's going to happen is it's going to backfire and blow up right in the four of your stupid faces. Because those stipulations happen to work both ways. And as I said before, the toughest man in the world don't come from Texas, he comes from Tennessee, and you idiots are looking at him right now. And when I beat one of those four idiots, I'm going to pick out that punk Jeff Jarrett, and we're going to beat on him for a minute, all four of us, and he will not be able to answer the bell. And you're looking at the winner of the Texas Tough Man Contest right now. Woo, Wednesday night, 400 Court Street at the Coliseum, that's where it's all taking place. Everybody knows the rules, so there can be no screaming and yelling when it's all over. It's a tough man competition, and we're going to find out how tough they are. Well, Jerry Lawler, if we happen to get lucky and get the first fall, we're picking you for a minute to see how tough you are. That's right, Bill. Like you said, Wednesday night's when it's going to take place. Texas Tornado Tough Man Contest. And yeah, you, Gaylord, I found out just how tough you are. Yeah, you're big and bad but I found out you can be had. And when you get in there, it's going to be four against one for one entire minute. And then when that bell rings, you're going to have a 10 count to get up. And I don't think you can. That's Wednesday night. We That's right. right in a while, sir. Wednesday night in Evansville. You don't see Mike Gossett right now. He's out hanging and banging for you. The big, fat Ryan Gossett and Jerry Lawler, we haven't forgot about you because Wednesday night in Evansville, my friend, Texas Tornado Tough Man Contest. We are going to beat your brains in. Beat your brains in wild side style. We'll do anything to get it, Ronnie P. Gossett. Now you got me in a Texas Tornado Tough match. Well, let me tell you something. When it comes to tough, I'm one of the toughest. And with the King Jerry Lawler here and these other two backing me up, I'm not worried one little bit. Because in the first place, you won't lay one hand on Ronnie Gossett. Jerry Lawler will see to that. And when the going gets rough, then that's when I really get tough. I'll lay my suplexes on you. I'll lay my pile drivers on you. I'll lay my DDTs on you. I'm not worried one bit. You talk about having one minute with me or Lawler or Sweet Daddy Falcon or Jeff Gaylord, you won't have 30 seconds because we're going to beat your brains out. Jeff Jarrett, Wimpy Bill Dundee, Chris Champion, and Mike Awesome. Can you believe that competition, King? Tell them. That's no competition. Whoever thought of this match 
We'll grab another thing coming when we get through with them. Just take a look at this right here behind us. These two guys alone would be enough to destroy you without the world heavyweight champion and Ronnie P. Gossett. It's all over.